What's going on YouTube? Welcome to or welcome back to Kovacs Corner. Appreciate you taking the time. If you enjoy the video, feel free. Leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Hit me up on any one of my other social media platforms down in the description below. Feel free. Join the Discord. All that stuff. We about to get back into it with another react video from one of Grubby's tier lists. Uh, the best hero death sounds in Warcraft 3. A tier list you may disagree with. Well, let's see if we disagree with what he has to say for his tier list. Let's get right into it. In the comments on my most recent Grubby Talks upload, the true value of upgrades, and I found this comment right there. Death sound tier list when? I thought that could be a pretty cool idea. So we've got our tier list here, and we've got all the sounds from the map editor where we can listen to the best death sounds. What is Blizzard's finest work in creating their death sounds? Let's jump into it and make a tier list. This isn't gonna be the strength of the heroes. This is gonna be the strength of their war cry. Starting <laughs> with the Pit Lord. You know, this guy. You fail to amuse me, pitiful. All right, let's listen to his death sound. Does he have a death sound? What is your feeble thrill before me? You fail to <laughs> Welcome back. He's gonna have to go through it and find the death sounds. That's funny. <laughs> back to Jaina in the morning. We're here with Mal Vendroth, hunter of night, and his girlfriend Kim. Now, Kim, you think you're here for a makeover, right? <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> Mal. Yo, that's awesome. Why don't you tell us why you're really here? <laughs> well, Kim Cake, I love you, but I have something to tell you. Uh, I'm a demon. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, more of a pit lord. What? I don't understand. Who's that phone? Oh, no. I thought you said you worked for the post office. Well, I moonlight. Okay. <laughs> A moonlight <laughs> at the post office. What a guy. <laughs> this isn't the Pit Lord's death sound. This is the <laughs> death sound of my tier list. <laughs> let's move on. Let's forget about Pit Lord. Right, let's go to the next. <laughs> okay. Pit Lord D. <laughs> we go to Beastmaster. <laughs> All right, what do you think? It's a pretty good death sound. It involves it a lot of good memories of me killing Beastmasters. I've killed far more Beastmasters than I've lost. I think it's solid acting. It definitely sounds like a half-orc, half-ogre dying. I would give that about, about an A. It's about an A, in my opinion. Let's see how grubby goes with it, but like I feel like it's an A. You can hear some dropping limbs and stuff. I think it's solid. It's a solid tier B or C. It's nothing amazing, but it definitely gets the job done. Well, if we're going for like amazing, right? Because uh, amazing is S to me. Uh, a is like, yeah, that's pretty close to a death sound. B is like, yo, you called it in. C is like, eh, and like D is pfft, nothing. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> uh, let's move on to the next hero. The next hero is going to be the Goblin Alchemist. This one should be pretty good. There's also a flag for an alternate sound, though I don't know if they put it in the game. <laughs> I never heard the first part. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like he has a washroom problem, dog. <laughs> because because it is a uh, it is an ogre and it is uh, the guy sitting on the ogre, which is a goblin, right? I always only heard the goblin. I didn't know that uh, the ogre himself first fell. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Oh, oh, no. oh, like he's losing his balance. Oh. I see. I get that. Oh, no! <laughs> this one's pretty good. That's a tier A death sound. It's pretty good. It's comical. I give it an A uh, By the way, notice That's how they flagged eight. it in the world editor. Hero, Goblin, Alchemist 
almost like they weren't sure that they're gonna add it and then they kind of added it as a joke because the hero is kind of like a joke um, <laughs> initially at least like it was kind of a meme for a long time but eventually he became useful with a couple of buffs but uh, that's a that's a cool death sound flame lord this took me a while to find apparently fire lord is flagged as a flame lord in the world editor this is oh. by the way the first time i've ever <laughs> opened the world editor and seriously used it for anything there's some things that are really easy to create in the world editor for most people i just started a single player game and waited until i got the unit that i wanted to make uh, there's definitely more efficient ways of using the warcraft 3 world but I've, I've never used the editor, so I opened it and I said... That's funny, because I've never used the editor either. I have no idea how it works. I would have done it the exact same way. <laughs> ...using the Warcraft 3 world. But I've, I've never used the editor, so I open it and I say, Hey, Fire Lord is the Flame Lord? Okay, I guess they changed his name later. Let's find his death sound and judge it. That's pretty cool. That's pretty good. I like it. Yeah. It's, uh... It's fast, it burns up fast, it sounds painful. I would give it an S because he's like molten and it just right away gone. You know what I mean? Kind of like if you were to extinguish a fire, just done. That's good, that's a tier A death sound in my opinion. I'd give it an S. Next up, Tinker. By the way, did the alchemist have a secondary death sound? Yes. Ah, maybe if he's in chem- It's like, it sounds more advanced, like you're able to hear it a little bit more. Ah, maybe if he's in chemical rage, he dies while dropping a weapon. Oh, here's a weapon drop. Interesting, yeah, maybe that's why he has an alternate, because it's a different unit, like he drops his sword. All right, Tinker. C. C. Well, like, yeah. Uh, B, C. You know, I'd, I'd expect a little bit more. I gotta say, it is on brand for the Tinker. The Tinker is kind of a mediocre voice acting job in general. It's very nerdy. Flat. It's a bit, like, goofy. I'm more than meets the eye. She'll hold together. Yeah, that that guy's nuts. Yeah. Grab him. <laughs> what you got? <laughs> I'm all geared up. The engine's running. All systems go. Bleh. Yeah, so I, I think his whole job is kind of a whack job, uh, kind of voice acting. The death, I, I think it's not fantastic. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say C or D, it's kind of hard to say. I think it's D tier. Overall, his voice acting is not amazing, though. By now, of course, I love it, just because of... I agree with D tier, with his tier, even though I put it tier C. It's like tier C, tier D. I agree. D tier <coughs> overall is voice Nothing acting is not amazing though. By now, of course, I love it just because of nostalgia, mere exposure. Uh, <laughs> Pandaren Brewmaster. <laughs> Pandaren Brewmaster is nice. <laughs> it's kind of well, Pandarian Brewmaster. You hear it more often than not, right? It's a regularly used unit that you get. Of a funny way of dying as well. Uh, that's gonna be a tier A for me. I, I was thinking tier A. I was debating whether or not tier A or tier S. But yeah, tier A right now. I like it. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a, it's an open bellied. It's maybe literally and metaphorically, it's an open bellied kind of groan and going down of the of the man. And it's funny too, because you gotta take in consideration that half the time he's drinking. Kinda sounds like a drunk person, man. Not gonna lie. <laughs> the half man, half panda, or Pandaren anyway. I don't know the exact etymology of the Pandaren, the exact biology or species of the Pandaren. <laughs> Alright, not bad, pretty good. Uh, Sylvanas is flagged as Sylvanus. <laughs> Sylvanus Windrunner. <laughs> if you play Warcraft 3, feel free to check that out yourself too, man. That's... Sally <laughs> <how> it is. <laughs> yes, Sylv... 
Anus. Sylvanus Windrunner. And then later on, they probably changed the name because they thought maybe there's going to be some people immature and they're going to run with that name and you'll get the wrong idea. It's funny because mad immature people think about if you were playing and you want to go that hero, oh, I'm going anus. <laughs> I just I just killed your anus. <laughs> your anus is shit. <laughs> immature and they're gonna run with that name and you'll get the wrong idea that is that is sylvanas they use the archer death sound yeah no it sounds like the archer death sound I'd, I'd give it a c tier oh she doesn't have her own death sound hold on a second wait is this just sylvanas but not dark ranger maybe dark ranger has her own banshee ranger <laughs> oh my god banshee ranger Ah, there we go. That's, That's it. Pretty That's cool. it. There you go. I'd give it an A or an S. Probably an S. That's pretty good. I mean, there, there's something I like about its unnaturalness. Because, of course, Dark Ranger is unnatural. It, she has been raised from the dead uh, by Arthas to punish. Uh, to punish the elves that defended some kind of elven town and then made it into be an undead. It sounds slightly edited. It does, but like... From like all the zombie video games and stuff that I've played, like Left 4 Dead and stuff like that, it kind of like cues up with that kind of sound, right? In my opinion, anyway. If you have a different opinion, feel free, leave it down in the comments. I'm still... I'm going to give it an S. It sounds electric, almost. There's something synthetic to it. But, like, think about a Frankenstein... Frankenstein's monster. Electricity, bro. <laughs> but I... But I do like it. But it's a little bit ethereal, but maybe that's right for this character. I'm going to say, probably, I'll give it a B. I like it. Uh, yeah, it sounds auto-tuned a little bit. Uh, I'm gonna give it a B anyway. I do, I do like it. It's gonna get a pass for me. I mean, it's very recognizable, which is also nice. So this is, this is not really Sylvanas. That's just an archer. Yeah, uh, it's a that straight sound up that they used there. I am the ranger general of this land. I can hit a bird in the eye. Dude, Sylvanas yeah. used to sound so different than from the World of Warcraft version that we know now. None may threaten the elf lands. You'll regret ever entering my forests. Come taste the wrath of the elves. For Quelthalas, I have a land to defend. She was so vanilla and generic back here. But of course she died and then she was remade. I think that does something to your uh, vocal cords and your mood. I don't imagine it'd be great for your mood. All right, next up, Archmage. I like the Archmage sound because he's on a steed, he's on a horse. I'm going to give it an S personally. I like the sound of it. That's just me. I think Archmage death sound is so happy. It's funny how different sounds can mean different things to some. I, I imagine to a human player, Archmage death sound is not great. I do slightly miss the fact that the Archmage on the horse doesn't have uh, any opinion. He is so uppity while he's alive. Don't you have a strategy? <laughs> Up while he's alive. That's fine. You require my assistance. What is it now? What is it now? Get on with it. This had better be worth it. I can like the king that he wants to be and or is. For glory. And it would have been nice to hear him die. Yeah, if it was him, not just this war. I'm still, I'm still giving it an S tier, man, because I love crushing the archmage whenever I'm up against humans. I love that sound. So I'm gonna give this a C. It is a relatively generic horse. It is recognizable. This voice, this sound also gets reused by one of the Archmage Renegade Wizard creeps that you can meet on some maps. I think there's a level five or a level four or three Renegade Wizard uh, from the bandits or something that can die that has the same death sound. And it's very confusing. Uh, and it's just a horse. But I do like hearing it. This makes me happy. 
<laughs> good things happened. All right, next up. They used to call this the Blood Elf. Uh, now we know him as the Blood Mage. This is his dead death. Blood Elf Sorcerer Death. <laughs> Does it really sound... Does it really sound like a death sound, right? And give it about a C. It's almost like it's been called in. <laughs> it's so bad, but it's also so good. <laughs> I feel like it gets better every time you listen to it as well. <laughs> this is, that's good. That's a tear ass. That's a really. But it's almost like Wilhelm scream. That's true. Just for the meme. Just for the meme, what a guy. <laughs> but their own creation. Some kind of uh, Wilhelm-like developer that works at Blizzard that said, yeah, I can I can do the Blood Elf Sorcerer Death, no problem, here I go. <laughs> oh, what is the little tippity-tappity sound right before it? It sounds like galloping horse. Choking. It sounds like steps. Oh, so he, st he steps and then he falls over. Stumbling, yeah. <laughs> uh, good. And how he dies face down, like face plant. Hey, nice. Uh, the hero <laughs> mountain king. The death sound, like his death scream is as short as he is. The, the mountain king has one of the least <laughs> noticeable models on the battlefield because he's so small. And his death sound is small as well. Done. I'm gonna give it an A because I can't hear the weaponry dropping. <laughs> then he falls over in quite a lot of cladded armor. It's a good death sound. It's quite. There you go. I can hear the armor. Yeah, still giving it an A. Still giving it an A. Abrupt. You immediately know what happened. I'm gonna give it a uh, B. I like it. Next up, the hero paladin. That's an S tier for me. S tier for me. Love to hear it. Sounds like he's uh, like he's kicked the bucket. You know that you've actually impaled him and all that and whatever. Pretty much for me, that's an that's an S tier. That one is really good. There's a lot of emotion. There's a yeah. lot of regret. There's a lot of retrospective. You can hear I feel it. like when Paladin dies, it is so dramatic. Everything flashes before his eyes. His order's failure to curtail Arthas's ambition and misdirectedness. Like he's, like he's actually hurt, like deep down in the soul, man. Like, why'd you do this to me, Arthas? With the whole story campaign in single player. That's what it sounds like. Like super disappointed and hurt over the fact that Arthas is is killing him. Yeah, it's S tier. S tier. He's so sad about what everything that happened with it, the leader of his order, Uther Lightbringer. Yeah, that is really good. That's a tier A for me for sure. I feel like human heroes overall die pretty well, uh, but I might be a little biased here. Uh, moving on to the next, there's the Naga Sea Witch. Would have been nice if she Give fell it about over a with a bit of slop, like a bit of moistness, don't you think? Yeah. Since she's a Naga Sea Witch, would it have been good if she, like, like splash. Or is it illogical? Because she's already on the land. But would it be good if it was kind of like a wet <laughs> slap, like the way a fish like sounds a splash, when you throw it on the ground? <laughs> because it sounds so tinny. It sounds very... Almost sounds like she missed her step, you know, and tripped over a curb. <laughs> right? Like, oh! <laughs> I'm gonna give it about a C. Yeah, about a C. Very tinny, like, she's not even wearing armor. She's just scales. It's not what I think scales or, or would, would sound like. Or, like, you know this, what Grubby's kind of talking about? The way how I could break down is, like, uh, you know when it's raining and you got puddles? And you're like walking in the puddles, like heavy footed. That's what that's 
the sound that I feel that he's trying to like explain with, with that little bit of a splashing sound for when she drops Naga Sea Witch, right? You would think that you would hear some water in the background with it. I, I agree. Don't think fish sounds moist when you throw it? Really? C could you look up a fish sound and send me the... Could you look up a fish throwing sound, Shifko, and, and let me know since you're an expert? <laughs> I don't know, I've never gone fishing. <laughs> let me slap some fish. Wait, wait, we can check. We can check. Monty Python fish dance. <laughs> it is true. Yo, he pulled up a mighty python short. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> if you know about Mighty Python, trust. If you don't know, check it out. It's pretty funny. True, it doesn't sound uh, wet. That's true. All right, next up, Hero Demon Hunter. No, that's not it. Demon Hunter Death Alternate. Is that when he dies in Metamorphosis? I've never seen it. If that's his, de if that's his Metamorphosis death, I've never witnessed it because he's too strong during it. Oh, oh, that's shit. the metamorphosis death that I know. Which, of course, I've never seen. Because <laughs> it's too strong. Oh, it's a fact. Uh, my lie. Uh, <laughs> alleged. Alleged. That's what I imagine it would sound like. All right, but <laughs> your story isn't adding up. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, we don't, we, don't, we don't have to talk about who killed who during Metamorphosis. Uh, it, this is not what it's about. We're not ranking his Metamorphosis death. We're just looking at regular Demon Hunter. I love regular Demon Hunter. For me, S tier. Because it, it sounds like he got stabbed. He's like, ah! And then he's like falling over with it in excruciating pain. It's S tier for me, man. I love it. I love it. Uh, if you don't know, the Demon Hunter actually gives up on life before you can kill him. It's his final victory in life. He actually commits Sudoku with his uh, uh, Seppuku. Sorry, I make that reference way too much. He commits seppuku with his uh, blades of azanoth actually i suppose the others don't have blades of azanoth right the the other demon hunters because this is generic demon hunter it's not illidan but either way they take their own life uh, at the very end which is why there's such a time lag between him like receiving near fatal damage and then the final scream <laughs> oh that's what it is that's what it is oh that's crazy. I haven't really seen that that art before. With him like juxting himself. I've I haven't seen that. Man. That's crazy. Green. <laughs> S tier. S tier for me. <laughs> Crubby man. <laughs> it's tier S. It's so good. Yeah. Man, people that are addicted to magic, Demon Hunter and Blood Mage, they die so good. S plus. Wonderful. Very good. Uh, next up, Keeper of the Grove Death. <coughs> <coughs> I can't even... He just sounds like he's, like he's sick. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, like, he coughed and got sick and keeled over, right? I'd give it a C. I'd give it a C. I can't even do this one. It's like, it's, um, there's a large exhalation of air. It's a very outwards groan. It's not internal, right? Like, it's, it's, but then it is also deep. It's sonorous. It's a deep, sonorous, exha exhaling groan, and I love it. I think it's A or S. You know what? I think it's an S as well. That's a fantastic thing. <laughs> Uh, no, it's an A. It's not as good as Demon Hunter and Blood Mage, but definitely tier A+. Plus. <sighs> Very fitting. Alright, next up, Priestess of the Moon. I'm straight up 
for me, uh, C tier. Very fitting. All right, next up, Priestess of the Moon. Ah! I like that. Very fitting. All right, next up, Priestess of the Moon. Because ah! you get to hear her tiger and her, right? Like, they both took that damage and are falling. One more. Very fitting. All right, next up, Priestess of the Moon. Ah! I'll give that an A. pretty good it's pretty good uh, I think it's a nice average it's an A or a B it's fairly I'd say it's fairly well acted uh, very obvious when she dies it has a lot of soul to it I think it's a B it's a solid solid B very nice B plus perhaps and yeah, she seems a little surprised about it as well because she was shadow melding I could say yeah I could see that I could see that warden oh I love this one yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love this one. Yeah. <laughs> it's even go and give her an S, isn't he? I think he's going to give her an S. I uh, an octave higher than I thought. I want to. I want to see the animation with it. <laughs> I don't like the scream really. Like I, I like it, but I feel like it's too high pitched for her, right? Because it, it kind of sounds like a little kid screaming. <laughs> <laughs> One more. Hold on. And if I had to read it, I, I'd, I'd give it a B. <laughs> It's so high. <laughs> that is so good. It's very surprising. That's a that's a tier S as well. Fantastic. Very high sound, but a very uh, yeah, falling like a sack of potatoes after that. <laughs> Thud. It's a very sudden death, for sure. Next up, Blade Master. I personally hate this sound. just sounds like like he's tired master i personally hate this sound it's almost like he's like yawning the way how it sounds to me it sounds like he's he's yawning a little bit and then falling into bed <laughs> uh, blade master i personally hate this sound i'm gonna give it a d i it doesn't sound like a death sound it does not sound like it does sound to me. In my opinion, I'd give it a D. It's so sad. It's so sad. That's a tier D for sure. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> Finally. Got a couple, bro. Every orc tier... I'm, I'm just going to say it. Every orc death is tier D. You hate it because of what it means to you? Yes. <laughs> they're all tier D. We're gonna listen to them, but they're tier D because they're orc deaths. <laughs> That's funny. Actually, TC death sound is not that bad because he comes back from reincarnation. Makes sense? Those are not all orcs. Well, these are all orcs. Yes, they are. Oh, okay. He's a torrent chieftain, but he's part of the orc race. All right, but for real though, let's, let's judge them for real. Okay, but it, it could be like, it could be almost any orc. I think it's a C. It's, it's I'm, okay, I'm it's pretty good. Maybe it's it. a B, okay, it's a B. It sounds good. I'm so um, objective about this. Next, next up, Farseer. I'm gonna give that about an A. I hate this sound too. I hate the sound too, because I love, I love Farseer. Right? Like thrall and shit. I, I love Farseer. I hate to hear the sound. But I'm it's gonna also, give it a B. It's not very characteristic. Oh. Definitely worse than Keeper. Uh, for Just because you know that, like, 
It's a death sound. Perspective? <sighs> there's a lot of air. There's a lot of sadness. There's a lot of progression. And this is just... <sighs> it's very short. I don't think it's good. I, th I actually think Farseer is tier D. Uh, in the death sound. What about Shadowhunter? <sighs> <laughs> you gotta give that an A. Kind of like the male version of my F, of Warden. Kind of. I have a feeling that when he dies, his legs went apart. Like he died in a split like this. I actually think that's how he dies in, in the game. It's pretty damn good. That's a tier A for me, for sure. Nice. I think it's an obvious tier A. What about Tauren Chieftain? <laughs> Not great either. Did no. orcs get shorted on death sounds? Are orc heroes underpowered when it comes to death sounds? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Underpowered for death sounds? Really? Because <laughs> the heroes overall are pretty OP. But let's go back real quick. Sounds? Are orc heroes underpowered when it comes to death sounds? <laughs> that is at most a C and you can't tell me any I was, different. I'm just going to say it's, it's a C. But when he does his revive sound with it, that's that's like tier tier A, like A my like top of B, top of B. I feel like we need to hear some good orc death sounds. Peon, for instance, <laughs> <laughs> like got winded real quick. <laughs> and then uh, grunts are pretty good. They're sad, but it's good. What about Batrider? It's something very short. <laughs> Next up, Cryplord. It sounds like like moving trees in a movie. Like trees getting pushed out of the way, up earth that moved out of out of the way. Crip Lord. The thing that I think really sells the Crip Lord's death is his dying animation. Uh, he kind of turns in on himself the same. I want to see the animation. Is his dying animation. Uh, he kind of turns in on himself the same way that spiders do um, when they when they die. He's like he, he's like collapsing in on himself, and I see that while I hear that. Hmm. Like collapsing in on himself, and I see that while I hear. That. One more. He's like collapsing in on himself. And I see that while I hear that, but I I'm going to rate it a B. Can't use that as a judgment when judging the sound. To be honest with you, I wouldn't even notice that. I, w I wouldn't even notice that as a death sound, but I don't I don't use them too often. It's it's a uh, it's very liquid towards the end. Did you hear that? Yeah, you could you could hear it like goop, like gooey, right? Like when you crush a bug in cartoons, where you go, that splat sound, a little bit. It's kind of yeah. It's there's moisture. There's there's serious moisture there. That should have been thrown on with the Naga Sea Witch. That moisture sound. It's good. I think it's a good give quality a sound. I'm gonna give that a tier A. Crippler dies well. Death Knight. <laughs> It's an A. I mean, an S -tier. This is cool because you can hear it's a man, but it sounds hollow. Yeah. Which, of course, they are. They are a hollow man. <laughs> and then there's nothing there. You expect some... There's nothing there because he's already gone, right? It's like zombified, bro. Straight up zombified. I, I'm giving it an S tier. <laughs> and then there's nothing there. You expect some... You expect something, but there's nothing there. And then... 
You hear? You can even hear his horse a little bit. You hear the horse? Yeah. I don't think you hear the horse. Oh ah! <laughs> Almost sounds like little whistles in the background. Horse. Oh ah! Yeah. Huawei. Huawei. That's true. Oh yeah, now I hear the horse. Yeah. The <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've never heard the horse that well. Uh, in ne ever. Uh, how's the death sound for Death Knight? I think it's not great. I'm gonna give it a, a C or a B. What do you guys think? I think it's a C or a B. Let's go. For, let's go with a B then. I'm gonna rate an S tier. Let's go with a B. Next up, Dreadlord. If I have wings, why am I always walking, imbecile? This is not a dress. It's the standard Dreadlord uniform. Yes. Oh, for the last time, I'm a Dreadlord, not a drug lord. All right, his death. <laughs> and, and, All right, his death. And, and, One more. All right, his death. Kind of sounds like he evaporates, which he kind of does, right? He ends up doing that circle around. Gwah. We're, we're going to see the death. I, I want to see the death, but it sounds really good to me. One more, hold on. Drug Lord. All right, his death. Just off the sound, I'm giving that an A. And, and he vanishes in a cloud of bats. I think this is real. See, like, it, it goes. And, and he vanishes in a cloud of bats. I think this is really good. It's yeah. very unique. I'm gonna right? give it an Because S, he has a actually. special death animation, they were able to play with it and make him sound more ethereal, otherworldly, and different. So rather than just normal death, they have managed to create a very unique sound that's a tier S for me. Next up, Lich. This is one of the most iconic ones in the game. It is very sad and it sounds like he calls for his mother. Oh. Mama. <laughs> to me, it's like, uh oh, that's what it sounded like, but now that uh grubby said that i'm not going to be able to unhear it for me that's an s tier not exactly but kind of oh, <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> and then you have the sound of him vanishing too right <laughs> it's, it's, it's a tier s it's so good <laughs> no it doesn't it does if you say it often enough it sounds like everything is leaving him yeah oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's very surprised that he didn't get death coiled on time by the death knight. I hate, I hate the sound of Lich falling. I hate the sound just because I love using Lich for undead. <laughs> it's a, <laughs> it's a death. Sounds like everything is leaving him. Yeah. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> He's very surprised that he didn't get death coiled on time by the death knight. Wait, I already did Naga Sea Witch. I forgot to place her. I think I talked so much about fish that I maybe forgot to place her. Yeah, the sack of potato sound, right? I'm giving that a D. Not very good. I'm going to give it a C. A C or a D. I'll give it a C. The swim sound. There's the... So there's like the splash sound. There's the splash that I was hoping for, but I guess it only makes sense when she's in the water. <laughs> Give it a with the splash sound, it's it's an A to me, right? But without it, it's a D. It's when she's in the water. <laughs> Give it a C. <laughs> Naga Sea Witch. The sea. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, last one, the pit lord. Wait, didn't we do pit lord already? No. Nah. Oh, pit. It's funny because at the beginning he was trying to do pit lord and stuff. <laughs> Did that whole little skit. 
Or didn't have a death sound, that's why. I need to replicate this myself. It's not in the in the files. Oh, they used Kodo for Pitlord? It's the same death sound? Or does Kodo have its own death? So lazy. How did I never notice? I thought I was so good at sounds I would always recognize a duplicate flag. And all this time, I did not know that the Pitlord and the Kodo have shared the same death sound. Mm. Is it lazy if nobody knows? So, because it's a shared sound, as, as he's describing, laziness on Blizzard's part for it. D. Notice? C or D. I mean, I didn't notice. Someone may have noticed. Mm. <laughs> nope. Let's fire up the game and double check. I can't believe it. Our forces are under attack. Can't hear shit with this chimera. It's the same! It is. It really is the same. It's the exact same sound. Oh man, so lazy. But again, is it lazy if nobody noticed? <clears throat> I suppose not. Alright, so how do we judge that sound? Kodo death sound, apparently. I don't think it's great. It doesn't sound like a pit lord. I feel like this sound was recycled from another unit. That's why it it's doesn't sound like D. the pit lord enough. Mm. It's a good sound for a Kodo, but it's not good for the pit lord. But it is a high quality sound, so I'll put it on a C. You didn't notice it. Yeah, true. <laughs> All right, that's it. That's my death sound tier list. What do you guys want to see next? We have a couple of options. We can do an item tier list. Which items are the best to find in a melee game of Warcraft 3? Claws of Attack, Loss of Haste, Ring of Protection, Endurance, Witch Tomes, etc. Uh, then we can do a tier list about something else. Any, any other ideas in chat? Tree tier list. Unit death sounds. Item tier list. Creep camp tier list. Which creep camps are best to take? I want to see the creep creep camp. I want to see the creep camp one. I want to see that. That'd be dope, especially to get the information from Grubby himself. You know what I mean? Who knows creep routes and what creeps to go and what creeps have what items and like which items drop. Current pro player tier list. Yes. That'd be and, cool. And their value as a human. A tier <laughs> list. Critter tier list. Which which critter is the best to get from the mechanical critter options? <laughs> which buildings to hide on the map when you've already lost? Good stuff. Wow. I'll, uh, I'll cook longer on the ideas. Alright, let me know what you guys want to see next. Thanks for watching this one. See you next time. Huge shout out to Grubby. So you're well, thinking I, of starting whoops. War... <laughs> Huge shout out to Grubby for his tier list there for the Warcraft community to react to. Uh, I ended up going along and I ranked what I thought where things should be as he did. Not everything matched up. How did you fare? Whether or not you matched up with my list, his list, or you came up with your own. Let me know down in the comments below. But with that being said, thanks again for coming through. I appreciate each and every single one of you. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll be seeing you guys next time, man. Peace.